Good morning, you guys. All right, so I just got done with my Target order pickup, which shoes yesterday and today are 50% off, um, which I need to go on Instagram and I'll let you guys know. So I picked up these for Kai. Um, these are little girls. They didn't have them in the toddler, um, but these are in a size one. These are a couple sizes too big for her, but for $10, I snaked them up as quick as I could. Um, she really loves them and she wants to wear them right now. So maybe with like a thick pair of socks, I'll let her wear these. But um, no, that is what I got for Kai. You wanna hold them? Yep, you can keep them in your box. And then I, so I got Riker um, a new pair of shoes as well, and those will be coming in the mail. And then I ordered myself two pairs of shoes, which the first one is like super, super edgy, and I love them so much. Um, I have giant feet, I have like size 10 feet, but um, I got these guys. These are so cute. And they've got like the snake print detail, the python or whatever. Um, and then they have, they're like, there's like a juti twine. Um, and then I also have, or, or, and it also has like this like recycled, like, I don't know, it's like a basket weave, but it feels kind of like recycled something. Anywho, I'm really excited about these. These, This is like my favorite color scheme ever. Um, and I'm a sucker for animal prints. So anyway, I will try these on when I get back home so that you can see what they look like on. Um, but yes, I got them for $15 because they were half off. Um, and then I also ordered a pair of like moto boots because, um, because they were originally like $35 and so like $17.99 or something like that when they were half off. Um, but when those come in the mail, I will show you, but I'm gonna head over to Instagram really quick and just give everybody a PSA that shoes are 50% off today only at Target. All right, so let's try this again. <laughs> um, it is Wednesday, I believe. Okay, so it's Wednesday, um, and I've been sick. I've been unwell. Um, I think it was just some kind of like tummy bug. But my aunt, like, it was so weird. It wasn't like a stomach flu feeling. It was like, I don't know. My tummy was just on fire. Anyway, um, I'm gonna go outside and check the mail. Today is the first day that I've been like feeling better because Monday afternoon I was wiped out. I had a little bit of a temp and I just wasn't feeling well. And then yesterday I was out for the count the entire day and now finally this morning I'm feeling better. I just got back from dropping my vehicle off at um, service because I'm getting new tires put on my car. So, all right, I'm gonna run outside, grab my mail, come back in and show you guys what I got. <laughs> oh, so you know what's really sad is my mail guy <laughs> calls me the package lady. I get that many packages where I'm known as the package lady. I'm embarrassed. So, okay, I got, let's see. I literally order everything online because the only places I go are Target Drive Up and Sam Club. What did I order now? What is this? Is anybody else late night order shit? Good, okay, actually, I really needed this to come in. Perfect. That was a floor guide for one of our customers at the barn doors. And <laughs> I forgot about these. I got uh, like legging biker shorts. You can't even see them. Like legging biker shorts. I'll try them on in just a minute here. Um, to wear with my oversized band tees because Because in the warmer weather, I don't have anything to wear um, with my oversized band tees besides the leggings. And I don't know, I just like seen like a bunch of people wearing them like that. So I'm gonna see if maybe now that I've like lost a little bit of weight, if um, like if it looks good on me. So anyways, and then I also got a Target package. 
So my Target package, this is from the other day um, when I was vlogging, I had ordered shoes during their 50% off sale and I got Riker a new pair of shoes because his are too small. He has super wide feet. Um, so I ordered him a new pair and they're so cute and handsome. Um, I think I got a size eight. So they are a little bit big for him, um, but that's okay. I'll just put some, he's got like thicker socks. That's usually what I do like with my kids when the shoes are just a little bit too big is I'll get him some thicker socks um, so that they fit nice and comfy. Um, and it's like this cute suede. It's got like a Velcro thing here. So they're easier for me to put on and off, hoping that he doesn't take them off though. Um, yeah. Anyway, so that is what I got him. Um, Kaya got those leopard print shoes. I think I showed you guys. Um, if not, hang on, I'll go grab them. Okay, so these are the shoes that I got Kai. I'm not sure if I showed these um, before or not. Um, I don't remember what the price was on them, but they were 50% off um, and she loves them. They are a little bit big for her as well, but I always order just a tish big so that they can grow into them a little bit instead of them fitting like 100% perfectly and then they're like too small within a couple months because both of my kids have really fast growing feet. I'm a size 10, so I've got really long feet myself. So anyway, okay, so here I am trying to be trendy. Um, I ordered some of those like moto boots. Ooh. Okay, so this is like more, a little more grunge than I normally dress. Like I, my go-to for shoes lately have been my steam Maddens. Like the, gosh, what are they called? Um, why am I? drawing such a blank they're like the slip-on sneakers anyway um, otherwise I've been wearing my Sperry duck boots just because it's super snowy here right now there's like a lot of snow on the ground and they're just they're practical they're not like the overly cutest <laughs> shape or looking boots here I'll show you these are my Sperry duck boots I mean I I used to be really really into these um, and I would style them with an outfit all the time, but now I just wear them out of practicality because it is snowy and it's wet and I don't want to ruin my nicer shoes, even like my sorrel wedges. So I wear those because with my nicer boots, I don't want to like ruin them from all the salt and the snow and stuff. Like when it's really like snowing outside. Oh my God, every single time I look outside, it like blinds me. Um, but anyways, these are my like fancy, like nice, um, winter boots I've got they're like the sorrel or sorrel wedges and I have them in like this like camel tan and then a like dark ish or like a medium brown and it's like a gray a gray felty um, with like a medium brown anyways um, I try not to wear these in like the super super deep snow um, this is more so like when I'm like going out in the winter time does that make sense Okay, and then, so here's the moto boots that I was talking about. As you can see, they're a little bit more edgy than the ones I've been wearing. Um, I was kind of hoping that they would come up a little higher, just because like with long feet, sometimes I feel like I need the, like the elongation. I don't know. That sounds so dumb, but that's just, that's how I feel. Anyway, I'm gonna try these on, see how they look. Um, yeah, and let's see if I wasted my money. <laughs> All right. We think, what is should I try these on? I'm getting all the notifications. Hi, buddy. Ah. No scissors, so I'm just gonna tear these bad boys off. Ooh. These definitely need to be like worn in because they're super like starchy, like just very stiff, you know? Oh my gosh. Me and my thick, wide feet covered in dirt snow because it is slushy outside. Am I fancy now? I don't know. Okay, I'm struggle. Okay, do not mind. Oh, see, you see what I mean? Makes me, quite a, watch out. Makes me look so. All right, sir. Make my legs because my legs are so long. 
These small little boots make them look so stompy. It takes like 10 hours for my camera to focus on me if I give up. All right, this isn't working. I'm going to take them off, but um, I'm going to keep them. I'm gonna look at the photos and watch this footage back actually is what I'm gonna do. And see if these bad boys are for me. I think I just need to style them correctly too. Maybe, I don't know. Anyway, all right, I'm hungry. That was a lot of work for me to do. Or like, I was like bouncing around. Oh, right after not feeling good. That was a lot for me. So I'm feeling a little nauseous now. So I'm gonna eat my salad and watch a show, which I'm not allowed to watch Sabrina without Mike. So I don't know what I'm gonna watch. I don't know. I have embarrassingly binged for the past two weeks, binged Bridgerton, all, both seasons of Virgin River, um, this like, ancient civilizations show it was that was like super interesting kind of scary it was a little scary um and now i'm almost done with sabrina i feel like i'm missing one in there too that's embarrassing all right so i showed you guys what i snagged from the target sale through like the shipping and drive up um, but I haven't shared the home goods haul that I have gotten for the kids' bathroom, which I will be sharing like in my next video of the organization part two video. I'm going to be sharing a little bit of me like redoing the bathroom. I need to get a feel for like what I want to do in there, but um, I think that this is a really good start. So um, I finally pulled these out. I haven't had any energy to even put them away or like decorate or record. If that like tells you guys like how I'm feeling, I've had zero energy to record or even get these out of the bags. So um, I'm finally feeling okay enough um, that I'm hoping to like get this up and going today so that I can share a really cute video on Sunday for you guys. I know that our schedule is like completely off this week. So anyway, okay, so I picked up this bathroom rug from Home Goods, and it's just like it's just white with like different textures on it. I'm really going for like a cozy, homey, um, comfy kind of boho vibe, but definitely cozy with some kid accents in there. Um, I also picked up. We've literally been using the same like um, like tub they give you when they send you home with baby um, from the hospital. We've been using the one that they sent us home with, Kaya, um, for like the past over five years um, for like cleaning, like for like scooping up the water and dumping it on their heads. It's like this blue bucket and we've had it since Kaya was born. And Koda, I don't think so. He really wants my salad. Um, anyway, so I got this hair rinse cup. It was $4.99 at um, Marshall's. My Marshall's and Home Goods are connected, so. Um, Anyway, that was $4.99 and it like kind of protects their head. It has that silicone thing to like protect their head so it doesn't get in their eyes. Um, and then I do have a toy net in the kids' bathroom right now too. I do have a toy net in the kids' I do have a toy net in the kids' tub right now too, but it just doesn't stay up very well. So I got um, it's like the same brand as that um, hair, the water pour, whatever. Um, the hair rinser. There we go. Um, but I, yeah, I grabbed it and it has like a, it has like a silicone thing on the back. It was $5.99 silicone thing on the back connects to the wall. My hopes are that that is a little bit nicer than the net that we've been using. Um, but we'll see, maybe I'll just use it in combination and see if there's a way I can fix the suction cups, cups on that thing. But um, and then the next thing I grabbed was this stool. Now I almost grabbed the donut one, but this one I thought was more classic. And honestly, I don't know what it is about this, but it like called me in. Now it's like, it's like carved out. It's not just painted on there. It's all carved out of the wood and it's just of such good quality and is adorable. And um, the kids right now for their stool, 
they just have um, like one of those cheap like Amazon ones and I thought that this was very like keepsakey and I don't know I do like to have some like elements like that um, in the kids' stuff even though I go for more like modern boho vibes you know um, I do like to have some traditional things too um, and then oh no Riker got out of his bed I'll be right back and because I've not been feeling well, I'm trying to be quiet because he's still trying to soothe himself back down. I haven't been feeling well, so I splurged. And I spoiled myself a little bit. I went to one of my favorite restaurants in town. It's called Doolittles. And I got their Cobb salad, which is so good. And I also got their wings. They're so good. Okay, just wanted to show you guys before I devour this. Hopefully I don't get a stomach ache. I need to go and check in with Riker. <sighs> Sleep training. Good morning guys. All right, I have no idea where this vlog is at and I know I've been gone for an entire week on YouTube. I'm so sorry. I got some kind of stomach bug and it has taken me like days to get over it. And I'm finally feeling better. So anyways, I will be back next week with my normal content. Um, I'm trying to get a video up for you guys on Sunday, but I do have my dad's 50th birthday this weekend, so I don't know if I will have time, but I will be back Monday, Wednesday, Friday next week, and that will be our normal uploading schedule from here on out. And I'm excited to be sharing all the day in the life videos with you guys. And I'll also be doing lots of like decorating. We're redecorating a lot of the house right now. And I'm excited to share the bathroom with you next. And don't miss out on part two to that deep clean and organize video because I also have the junk drawer in there. I've got all of the bathrooms. I've got all the good things. So I'm hoping to get that up probably Wednesday next week. But we will be back to our normal schedule here from here on out. I hope you guys enjoyed this like miscellaneous vlog. I've got kids on the table. I've got cats on the table. We're trying to get ready to go to the cities. So I am going to leave you. Please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And if you're excited for all of the new videos coming out in the very near future and getting back to a normal uploading schedule. And if you guys are new to my channel, I would love if you consider subscribing and joining our little family that we have here on YouTube and over on TikTok and Instagram and all of the things. I love to update you guys on like my life, my decorating, my keto, and my weight loss, and all the fun things, kids meals, everything, all the ideas for being a hot mess mama. So anyways, all right guys, I will see you on Monday for another day in the life. Okay, bye guys.